SNC Lavalin's very first assignments more than a century ago were in the power sector in Quebec. And since then, we've installed enough capacity to power 35 cities the size of New York and enough transmission and distribution lines to circle the world almost three times. We're now building on that legacy with some incredible projects. In the nuclear sector, we're the leading supplier of CANDU technology with projects underway here in Canada as well as selected international sites spanning three continents. We're also one of the world's leading providers of engineering and construction services to the hydropower sector. Our long history in Quebec's hydro market is continuing with our recently completed upgrade of the Shipshaw Hydro Facility for Rio Tinto Alcan. And recently in BC, we were just awarded the John Hart Replacement Project, which has an innovative design concept where the powerhouse will be built underground. The station represents 17% of the total generation capacity of Vancouver Island. Another ongoing BC project is the Juanita expansion, where our team has done a great job into every aspect of the project. Here's what makes Juanita so remarkable. The Juanita project is important for the uh, citizens of British Columbia. It's bringing 335 megawatts to the grid, probably enough to feed 40,000 homes. Alors, un élément très intéressant du projet, c'est qu'on ne construit pas de barrage. So what we do is we tap into the reservoir and we're building a new intake structure off on the uh, right bank, tunnels to a powerhouse, and then the water flows back into the river. So it's kind of like bypassing the main dam. Nous avons apporté le projet grâce à une innovation assez intéressante. La façon dont on a orienté la centrale nous a permis de réduire l'excavation et de minimiser l'empreinte environnementale de la centrale et d'ensemble du projet. Ça nous a permis de faire des économies et d'avoir un projet qui était très justifiable pour le client. There are a number of endangered species on the site, including critters, things that creep and crawl, and plants. So environmental management plans outline all the environmental measures that need to be taken based on commitments with the Department of Environment and Water Resources. The First Nation that we worked uh, with a lot um, is the Tanaha First Nation. One of the things that we saw that was important from other projects where we were involved with First Nations is that we have to have a direct link into the First Nation. So we hired a community First Nation liaison person that works for me, and uh, I think that's going to go a long ways for SNC Lavalin if they do that. La chose dont je suis le plus fier dans ce projet, c'est la collaboration que on a su établir SNC Lavalin et l'ensemble des entrepreneurs, la communauté et le client. I'm very, very proud of the team that we've put together because a, a group of very uh, professional people. We're on schedule, or slightly ahead, and we're on budget. And what also makes it special, I think that if you look around the site, people are happy. We're all very proud of this project. <laughs> <laughs>